The opening session of book one of the Tattersall's October yearling sale saw a trio of Dubawi yearlings sell for over a million guineas, with a 1.5 million guinea session topper setting the tone for what is Europe's premier yearling sale. The three lots to surpass seven figures were all signed for by Sheikh Mohammed's Godolphin operation, including the session-topping colt from Hazelwood Bloodstock out of Ring the Bell, a full sister to Hydrangea, Hermosa and the United States, who was bred on the same Dubawi Galileo cross that has proved so successful for Godolphin's exciting young sire, Knight of Thunder, amongst others, a fact not lost on the successful bidder, Anthony Stroud. Well, we all collectively really liked him. He was by Dubai, who's the champion sire. He came from a very good stud farm. He had that Galileo cross, which is um, so good, or nicked so well with, um, with Dubai. And, he, you know, his physical um, makeup, and was, we were pretty determined to try and acquire him, you know. When you talk to someone like Charlie Appy, who's done so well and trained so many of them, he will say that they're mentally very, very strong and you can give them work and you can give them more work and they relish it and improve and get on. And I would think um, that's one of the... Their mental strength is, is probably the main thing. And... The fact that they can win at six furlongs and win at two miles, I think they're pretty um, versatile, you know. The first of the seven-figure lots to set the tone for a day of robust trade was lot three, a Dubawi filly out of Group 1 Prix de l'Opera runner-up Jazzy Top, who sold for 1.3 million, again to Anthony Stroud on behalf of Godolphin. The daughter of Dali's leading sire was sold by Mion Valley Stud, whose long association with this foundation family has boasted past success for both the purchaser and consigner. We were absolutely bowled out. I mean, we, we hoped she might make sort of, I don't know, seven, eight hundred, maybe, maybe even a million, but she went way over our expectations. But uh, she had had proved very popular down at the stables. So we thought she was going to go quite well. A lovely individual, and she's a really good walker and uh, beautifully put together and great temperament. Well, she's from a great family, uh, Neon Valley, and funny enough, Shape Mom had bought um, Cave Tire and Opera Heist and, and Dine in the Third Dam, so we've, we've been uh, visiting it for a long time. Uh, she was just a, a very, very nice, very athletic from an excellent farm and you know she's got her mother was a good race mare so that's that's why uh, we desired her really yeah. The third of the Dubawi yearlings to break the million guineas mark when secured by Sheikh Mohammed's Godolphin operation was lot 127 a colt out of group one winning mare Persuasive who was sold by the colt's breeders Chivley Park Stud. He was very much a sort of Dubawi in make and shape um, out of uh, a Group 1 winning mare, she won the QE2 um, and gave uh, Mr and Mrs Thompson a, a fantastic day uh, beating the likes of Ribchester and Churchill so uh, she was a very talented filly herself and um, yeah he was, um, from the day he, you know, he was born he was always impressive, he had a fantastic head and jaw um, great movement and um, a real sort of Dubawi in every, in every sense I suppose Creative Force had been successful for uh, Sheikh Mohammed who were very grateful that he uh, bought him, very grateful indeed Watership Down Stud caught the interest of a strong buying bench on the day when offering for the first time at public auction a filly from the immediate family of Dare Mi. Lot 24, a Sayuni offering out of Lati Da, herself the Group 2 Middleton Stakes winner and St Ledger runner-up, who is a Dubawi full sister to the European champion two-year-old and exciting young sire too darn hot. The hammer came down at 880,000 guineas in favour of Shadwell Stud, with Angus Gold, acting on behalf of Sheikh Hissa, stating the desire to add high-class fillies to the Shadwell Broodmare Band as the motivating force behind the purchase. A strong group of international purchasers made their presence felt on day one, with a new face joining the list of buyers in Philip von Ullmann, acting on behalf of Gestuk Schlenderhahn alongside agent Tina Rao when securing a no-nay never filly out of Multilingual, a half-sister to Kingman from Camus Park Stud for 780,000 guineas. We were, were delighted because uh, she really was a filly that uh, we had on our list for a long time and she really... we. We came to Newmarket thinking, okay, we're going to look for fillies that will really also be added value to our breeding. And she really is one. She's out of beautiful Donsley mare, complete outcross, so we'll never have problems breeding her. And 
She looked like a queen. She is a queen, and we're very happy.